Brewers started their season games 110 through 115. The Brewers would lose 6 to 4 on August 3rd. DJ Hurts with the win, Aaron Savali with the loss, Kyle Finnegan with the save. Kyber Ruiz will put on the first round of the game for the Nationals, scoring in Luis Garcia. Travis Blankenhorn would hit a two RBI double, making it 3 to nothing. Alex Cole would hit an RBI single, scoring in Travis Blankenhorn, making it 4 to nothing. Luis Garcia would hit his 12th home run of the year, a solo home run, making it 5 to nothing Nationals. Jackson Churio will put on the first one for the Brewers in an RBI single, making it 5-1. James Wood will hit an RBI single, making it 6-1 Nationals. Reese Hoskins will hit home run number 19 on the year, making it 6-2 still Nationals. The final two Brewers runs will be a wild pitch by Kyle Finnegan and an RBI single by Gary Sanchez. Sunday, August 4th, the Brewers lose 4-3 to the Nationals. Luis Garcia will hit a solo home run, making it 1-0 his 13th of the year. James Wood would hit a bases clearing triple, making it 4 to nothing Nationals. The first run for the Brewers would be a RBI force by William Contreras. Gary Sanchez's eighth home run of the year, a two-run home run, would make it 4 to three, still Nationals. Tuesday, August 6th, the Brewers would win an absolute blowout against the Braves, 10 to nothing. Colin Ray with the win, Brewers Elder with the loss. The first run for the Brewers would be an RBI triple by William Contreras, scoring in Bryce Durang. Willie Adams would hit home run number 18, a two-run home run, making it 3 to nothing. Brewers. Joey Ortiz will hit an RBI single, making it 4 to nothing. Brewers. Willie Adams will have a two home run day, his 19th home run of the year, making it 6 to nothing. Bryce Ring will hit an RBI single, scoring in South Freelig, making it 7 to nothing. William Contreras will hit a two RBI double, making it 9 to nothing. Then another RBI double by William Contreras will make it 10 to nothing. Wednesday, August 7th, the Brewers win 8 to 5 against the Braves. Freddie Peralta with the win, Pierce Johnson with the loss. Austin Riley would tack on the first run with an RBI double, scoring in Jorge Soler. Matt Olson will hit a sack fly, making it 2-0. An RBI double by Joey Ortiz will make it 2-1. Joey Ortiz would this time get an RBI single, tying it up at 2. Blake Perkins would hit the go-ahead RBI single, making it 3-2. Austin Riley would hit home run number 16, scoring in Whit Merrifield, making it 4-3. Gary Sanchez would tie it up back at 4 with an RBI single. Blake Perkins would make it 6-4 on a 2-RBI single. Joey Ortiz would make it 7-4 on an RBI double. Andrew Monasterio would make it 8-4 on an RBI single. Jared Kellenick's 13th home run of the year, making it 8-5, would be the end of the scoring for that game. Thursday, August 8th, the Brewers would win 16-7 against the Braves. William Couture will hit home run number 13, making it 2-0, also scoring Garrett Mitchell. Sal Freelick would make it 3-0 on an RBI single. Jackson Churio's 13th home run of the year would make it 5-0, also scoring Bryce Terang. Garrett Mitchell's second home run of the year would make it 6-0 Brewers. Willie Adams would be the first Brewers player to hit 20 home runs in 2024, making it 7-0. To Eric Haas's RBI single would make it 8-0. Austin Riley's 17th home run of the year would make it 8-3 Braves, scoring in Jared Kalanick. And Whit Merrifield. Jake Bowers' 9th home run of the year would make it 10-3, scoring in Self Relic. Jackson Churio's 14th home run of the year would make it 12-3, scoring in Bryce Terang. William Contreras will make it 13-3 on an RBI double, his 30th of the year. A bases loaded walk to Andre Montesario will make it 14-3. Marcelo Zuna's 33rd home run of the year will make it 14-4. Eli White would hit a 2-RBI double, making it 14-6. An RBI ground by Marcelo Zuna will make it 14-7. An RBI single by Stel Freelick will make it 15-7. And then the final run of the game, Joey Ortiz with an RBI single, making it 16-7. Friday, August 9th, the Brewers will win 8-3 against the Reds. Aaron Savali with the win, Carson Spears with the loss. Willie Adams' 21st home run of the year will make it 3-0, scoring in Jackson Churio and Garrett Mitchell. Joey Ortiz will make it 4-0 on an RBI double. Bryce Terang's 7th home run of the year will make it 6-0, scoring in Joey Ortiz. An RBI triple by Sal Freelick will make it 7-0. The final run for the Brewers will be an RBI single by Reese Hoskins. Spencer Steer's 16th home run of the year will make it 8-1, still Brewers. And the final runs of the week would be Stuart Fairchild's 8th home run of the year, making it 8-3. So the Brewers are now 66-49, and 49, and the Brewers' respective Brewers player of the week goes to Willie Thomas for having like 5 home runs.